bite in a couple a years. A bite. A bite. Oh. Yeah, yeah, be ready to. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> we hey. blessed, we blessed by the most high. We Power up. Project that we just dropped on and raised. Word. I heard that's a reggae. It's a strictly hip hop reggae, reggae, reggae right. influence, all produced by Beat Nick and K Salon. Mm. And it's um, Smooth. Smooth. it's a, it's actually an EP, but we got different packages for it. You can get the six um, joint EP, you get the ten joint with some hoodies, which. My PNC is so proudly rocking. Mm. You could get a meet and greet package. You could get a meet, greet, and smoke package. Mm. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, how do we get the meet and greet package? So what you can't fuck. Smoking it. Yeah. 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 What you think about them trying to make weed legal in New York City? Mm. I don't smoke, so I really don't give a fuck. I'm going to sell it either way it go. I mean, <laughs> that's, we got to get it how we going to get it. What that's you that, think, Mike? That's, that's uh, I, I'm, I'm glad uh, 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 Bloomberg the fuck up out of here. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that we, we already been making it too uh, complicated than what it need to be. He made Jersey it already real, real done, Jersey already done com converted. You know, we right across the border. There's like, certain parts of Jersey. Yeah, yeah certain parts of Jersey, but I mean, I mean, listen, man. We right there, right across the border. We right there. We so close. Mm. Mm. You know? Man, still wants that vegetation legalized. Legalize the vegetation. Not, not that, you know, I can't. What's with all the name changes? Because, you know, I grew up, y'all was bucked down Smith & Wesson. Then y'all switched it to the Coco Brothers. Then now y'all back to Smith & Wesson. What the hell is going on? Mm. Well, well, you know, when we first came out, it was Smith & Wesson, which we was always tech and steel, steel right. and tech. Mm -hmm. Coco Brothers was actually our original name before we even came out of Smith & Wesson because we did so much things that for that reason, but... Marijuana. And then it Marijuana. Just be real, nigga. Going then, back to we the weed. so <laughs> much weed. But then what happened, Smith & Wesson tried to sue us saying we was confusing the consumers. They didn't know whether the people was buying music or they was buying handguns or whatever. Mm. Okay. That's so right. we had to fight that for a couple of years. Right. But, I mean, till the day we die, Smith & Wesson taking steel with Joe, right. Mr. Ripper, Mr. Vixen. That's what it is. Oh, legendary mm. shit. Oh, God. Kids, just keep calling. They must have shit. a question uh. for Tech or Steel. Oh, baby. <laughs> All right. So, what made y'all go into this reggae route? Yeah, because that's I mean, that's some left that, field shit right now. Yeah, I mean, because we as when we first came out, you know, being that from we from Brooklyn, Bed Style. I'm let's go. from Bed Style. My PNC is from Brownsville. So, being born and raised in Brooklyn, you in the melting pot of all different type of religions all different eth ethnicities right, right. that's coming up, backgrounds in the world. Mm -hmm. And Brooklyn is a hot melting pot for a bunch of Jamaican, Guyanese, mm -hmm. Panamanians, Tibetans, whatever the case Lively. may be. You see, you come through the Eastern Parkway on Labor Day, we got the spot jumping. Lively. Big up my people's USG, Swan Gotti. So Dig it. You, you, we give it up in that type of way. For me, personally, I wasn't born in the islands, but I hang out with the Jamaicans, I mm -hmm. hang out with the Dreads, so they automatically assume, you know what I mean? Because I speak that language, I understand it, so it, 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 it makes it easy for us to communicate and bridge a gap for what it is. Love is mm -hmm. and being that we started out with this, not, I'm not saying we started it because you had, you had Foxy that was doing this, you had KRS that was doing this, you had um, Mo D, you had Just Ice that was doing this, and they was doing it well. Mm -hmm. We just perfected it on our level as a Smith & Wesson thing from these niggas from Brooklyn that came up from nothing and was bringing it back to our hood, so we just stood out a little bit more with it. But it's been talks about making that type of music or that type of album for us for a minute. A lot just, the most high just presented itself to make it this day and time was the right time to do it. I, I used to stay musically motivated because you know you, you're both from Brooklyn, so that right that that energy gives you that musical you know inspiration. But now you know how Brooklyn's changing, especially in your hood, Bed Stuy. Yeah, 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 it, yeah. It looked like straight white cocaine riding bikes all day, <laughs> condos for five grand a month. Hey, so I don't know, you know what I'm saying? When you out there, like you know. You from Brownsville, it's 
it's gonna be a long time before the, you know, they take that. <laughs> Perhaps <laughs> <laughs> East New York is gonna be like, yeah, you know. It's gonna oh, take a bit. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is. It is what it is. True. And truthfully True. talking, I don't listen to the radio. Yeah. I don't. I don't get caught up in what's playing on the radio. I listen to my PNCs. And I keep a tight circle with my PNCs and my family and my people that I came up with. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, Thorough, we came up with Thorough for a long time yeah, from the beginning right. of, yeah. of rocking and joints. They can tell you this is what you see is what you get with me with my PNC. Mm -hmm. So, to keeping it to what it is, we just stick to our guns, where we came from, fatigue and Tim's, as you yeah. already know. Tim's all season for ass kicking reasons. <laughs> all season yeah, for ass kicking yeah. reasons. He'll tell you, I went on the IG looking for the forties for like nigga. I, I, he got the forty balloons the right now. They gotta bring these to me. I don't need to go to no store. They gotta bring right. these to me. Right. So, I mean, right. this is what we Throw came from. Out 40 this is what we came from. <laughs> so this is all we really know. You know what I mean? So to switch or to come any different way would be something different and hard and fucked up for us. So, right. What do you feel like? Has any young artists approached you? Cause like I see Drake. Ain't, no, ain't nobody approaching us, man. Ain't nobody. I'm approach. talking about to do a, a collab all together. Would you ain't do a Drake record? Listen, no, 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 listen. no, 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 no. Ain't nobody approaching us, man. Ever. No. <laughs> so, so Drake came up. Nah, to nah, 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 nah. Oh Lord. Let's this do my talk. PNC, Let's man. Mm -hmm. Don't cut off his wisdom, like. That. Okay, let me hear. If ain't nobody approaching us, ain't nobody approaching us. But to do collabs like that, then yeah, it's been, it's been. Groups out there that has reached out to Duckdown. Like, Duckdown has been like the number one independent label that's been doing this for years. That's been Period. signing joints. Mm -hmm. Period. We had, we had Be Real from Cypress Hill do a dolo right. joint. We Period. had Sky Zoo, right. one of the dope MCs. Right. That's KRS One. Right. Period. KRS. We had Talib. Period. We had. We had Period. Plug, uh, we had De La Soul. Perfect. So, I mean, and we got Joey Badass, our little homie. Yeah. So, even though talks be, be about how everybody is, you know, they can hear that in them or they hear us in them, it's, it's, it's all a part of a salutation, salute, and big up to the people that's coming up and do it. So, when you ask, yeah, have they approached? Yeah. Do we fuck with everybody? Nah, we don't. Mm. Nah. So it has to be a certain amount of respect there between whatever it is, champion, contender, killer, who gonna be killed, whatever it is, shooter and a gunner. It's certain things that we take in consideration, you know what I mean, before we just jump on the track. It's not a monetary thing for us. It's never been that way, and that's why we still get the respect. Why respect still. Still. So, I don't know if still remembers. But I interviewed Steel about oh, two, three years ago. <laughs> you gotta wait. You gonna bring up old shit. I ain't got I'm gonna bring up old shit. I ain't got nothing to do with that one. No, you, you got something to do with it. I want your opinion. Talk to you. When y'all did, when y'all did, no, you wasn't there. See? When y'all was doing the Bucktown, Absolutely. home of the original Gun Clappers, mm -hmm. that. you know, Flow a Tree came out and used your track. Same, same. And I was like, oh, that's the hotness. They should have had y'all on the remix or something. Facts. What? What a thought! What was the thought process behind hearing, you know, them singing on the track, and then your track? I mean, you want? Nah, for, no, for no, me, no, I don't want to add on to that. You know what I mean? For me, I don't, I don't take it no way. They say, let me get it right. Let's say, uh, something is the best form of flattery. Imitation. Or Imitation. Imitation is the best form of flattery. Right. When you know you did something that you supposed to have gave credit to or reached out to that person, then you feel away within yourself. You know what I mean? You can't. Me yeah. as an individual, I don't pay that shit no attention. Like I said, I, I don't. I don't deal with this. I want to say world on this level because I don't deal with this shit. Mm -hmm. For me, success is something totally different. When I deal with family and my people that's close with me. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's other people that been that. I get a call every day. Y'all want to remix Bucktown? I want to miss remix sound. Boy, I tell them nah. I suck a dick. I don't do that. Mm -hmm. it's, oh. it's certain things. <laughs> like for me, it's certain. Music out there that you don't remix. Like certain joints from Big, I won't remix. Mm -hmm. Certain joints from Pot, I won't remix. Certain joints from anybody out there that I feel that I look up to, a Slick Rick, Coogee Rap, they music, I won't 
rhyme on them tracks. Even a, a Raekwon or Wu-Tang, I won't rhyme on certain tracks mm -hmm. because I think that shit shouldn't be touched again. Mm -hmm. okay. let, let, let greatness be greatness mm -hmm. and move on to something different. Pete Rock has that same thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm a fan of it. So if they would have took the right routes and been like, yeah, oh, call us in for a remix, then why wouldn't I? Mm -hmm. That would have been something, that would have that would have bridged another generation gap. That would have brought their fans to our fans and our fans and vice versa, our fans to their fans. Mm -hmm. So it would have been dope in an all around 360 <coughs> circle. So it, it, yeah. It was being cheap. They didn't want to pay you, you know. Yeah, you, you they they it's not about, it's yeah. not about paying. Yeah, they have to pay. though. It's not about not, If it's your record, they nah, should you know what? to it's put not, you it's on. Not, it's not our record. It's huh? not our record. It's I don't not, know who did it. It's their not beat. our record. I know the beat miner did. Beat miner, okay. Mm. I know somebody. It's not did. our record. Yeah. Like, but they should pay how much you have. You know how much. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me hear this. Let me hear this. Yo, I know you know the original. Chill, don't hit him, son. What are you talking about? Don't hit him. We're talking about the flow, Chief. No, I'm going to let him rap. All right, I'm gonna let him rock. We're talking right, about the flow, right. I wanna hear what he's talking yeah, about. What happened? Come here, Steph. Nah, 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 nah. Come on, Steph. Come on. Yo, what the fuck? Pawn itself, pawn itself. You're talking about the flow tree record, right? I'm talking about. That's listen, then one of y'all niggas better not hit me. I'm in both the fuck. What happened? What did I miss? Nah, I'm just fucking around. Oh. 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 Okay. Tell us your point. My point is, like, we all come from somewhere. Mm -hmm. right? Like, where we come from, like, nobody can say that this is what I wanted to be. Mm -hmm. If you if you start from a, a, a place, right, and you say you're willing to uh, see how it, how it, how it, how it pans out. Well, well, it pans out, right? That's the real, for me, where I'm from, I'm from Brownsville. That's where I'm from. Where motherfuckers have to see what what pans out. Mm -hmm. Now, what I what I have learned through my through my trials is how it pans out is Smith and Wesson. So when I come to that, when I talk to people, I start from there, mm -hmm. right? I start from there. That conversation becomes really real to people, and I hope that you understand what I'm talking about because it's a, it's, it's a lot of different things that come to me. I mean, like I come from a certain place, he come from a certain place. You talking about relationship, you talking about neighborhood shit, you talking about dedication, you talking about a lot of different things. Like hip hop just starts becoming like very thin. Mm -hmm. If you ever, if you're from Brooklyn and you walk down uh, Marcus Garvey Boulevard right mm. now, today, mm. it's going to be different for you. But you yeah, want to know, especially if you never experienced yes. from before. Right. Yeah. My mother's from Brooklyn, so I, yeah. I know. So, yeah. from me, yeah. everything, that, everything that Smith & Wesson has been about, it's been about Brooklyn. Not because we just rep that only. But that's where we from. So how we rep, how we from, when you see that shit coming across, it's no way in your fucking mind that you can even absorb that without knowing that these people exist. So now that you know that these people exist, now you're going into the lifestyles of what happens when these people exist. What's happening be behind that? What's happening behind the two first? So where, where, where we at right here behind? What, what are we dealing with as far as a born and raised? What, what the fuck does that mean? What, what does it mean to a person to be born in a certain place and raised in a certain place? And it's, it's the same thing. Solidifying where you from and where you grow and how you move forward and owning all of this shit. Motherfuckers ain't even, they can't even absorb where Smith and Wesson is. Look at this. Still my people. I'm, uh, yeah, I feel you. Absolutely. I'm just saying, like, what we had, what we, what, what, what was given to us, we absorbed that shit, and then we took it to a whole other level of growth and development. We made people be like, you looking at this radio station right now. 
You know what I mean? Like everybody in this place holds a place of power. So power is what we're playing with. This is not no fucking bullshit that we're dealing with. When Smith and Winston come into the place, everything that we talk about, we talk about what we like PNC thing, you gotta understand what that means. You know what I mean? When you find somebody who you really fuck with, who understands what you're trying to do, you're not trying to do no bullshit. Mm -hmm. You're trying to take it to another level where we can grow and develop and we can eat our food. And we can spread our food across to our straight like that. Mm -hmm. That's everybody. Right. The ladies, the shorties that was fucking with us, the homies that was fucking with us, family, I for eat our food. Now mm -hmm. I got to ask some questions. I already see you, Tech. That's Speaking of the That's ladies, talk. Tech, don't you walk away from this. That's place. talk. Come on. 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 Ladies, <laughs> I don't know. Absolutely. After the show, I don't even run into my room. Yeah, I don't even run into my room. Now, can I get off? After the show, now, can I get off? After the show, now, be shooting to my room. Tell, tell, tell yo, knock it off. We all, we, 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 we all have, 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 what you asking? What you asking? <laughs> I'm asking y'all, not just him. You too. You ain't asking me. Oh, I'm asking. <laughs> you asking? I'm asking. What's one of your most memorable experiences How? with the ladies? <laughs> Come on. With the ladies. Life. And you, oh, and you filming this shit? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm just you know gonna want to talk over his wisdom. I don't want to talk over his wisdom. You know what I'm saying? All right. Life. 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 All right. I want to say that. I want to say it. I want to take it. Take it. Tech do go to his room, but Shucky Ducky definitely be Shucky. And you were talking with the gun in your hand, man. And Daryl could verify that because he actually took his girl too. Oh, shit. Was this in Germany? Because you don't know how to go to Germany. After we sign autographs, or we perform and have a good show, have a good time, I'm out. Real nigga shit. Real nigga shit. Why not? Oh, oh, man, that's, that's how you got to do it. No, 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 Oh, I'm married. <laughs> Tricky that, yeah. yeah. Still? Your marital status? My marital status, I, my lady, my, my lady is, uh, <laughs> <laughs> my, lady, I'm my lady is Cynical Smith, that's my lady on, on some real shit. Um, that's, that's the person who's been holding me down since I ain't know that I needed to be held down. Mm. Mm. So okay. it's like, you know, mm. it's like respect. We've been rocking with people who we've been rocking with. Like I know I know a lot of people that's in this room, you know, that we have we we haven't put our relationship on, on you blast. know, mm. on blast. Mm -hmm. But we 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 want that. Like Everybody, everybody, uh, uh, responsibility is upon themselves. Okay. So, like, you know, like, being with my PNC, he helps me. To calm down. I, I guess if that's what you want to say. It's just Bam. that I did, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Smith & Wesson live on This Is 50 he's Radio. he's very, very calm. Yeah. I'm a Gemini. You guys are on Twitter, yo? Oh, he said I'm on Twitter. They both we on, on Twitter, Instagram. We live, you know, we Twitter, on Twitter, Instagram. We on Instagram, we on... Tech Smokey Live either or Twitter or Instagram. He's so hot, somebody just said, fuck it, I don't uh, care, I don't uh, like you anyway, I'm gonna just, it's a... Uh, but we're not even talking about, I don't even know, <laughs> we're not talking about that though. Yeah. Nah, yeah. but that, so nah. it's about the album, yeah, right? so it's about the album. Born and Raised, Born and Raised, EP, out uh -huh. there right now, iTunes, Duck Down, and oh, 
the thing I wanted to say before we get ready to start a new boot camp album, we get ready to start working on it. Well, Helter Skelton on Yes, sir. Oh, 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 yes. That's it, my brother. Look out for that, then. Yes. You got it? Come on. That's born and raised. That's the born and raised. That's the born and raised 45. Come on. 45. It's the 45. 45. I just said we get ready to start working on it. Don't worry, we got you. Jesus. Somebody. All right. <laughs> so listen, y'all are gonna, gotcha. are y'all gonna, um, are they on that thing on Friday, on that concert? Nah, nobody reached out to us. Oh. Nah, I mean, yeah. I, I, our big brother Buckshot is up on the joint Friday, so okay. mm, we might slide through, we might oh, stop the party or something. You have to. You stop have to. the party. Because I'm, I'm calling somebody, where's AB? Soon. Somebody we got DJ